Today we're looking under array 2, problem sum 6, 7. The problem says return the sum of the numbers in the array, except ignore sections of numbers starting with a 6 and extending to the next 7. Every 6 will be followed by at least one 7. Return 0 for no numbers. Okay, so looking, let's look at the examples. The first array has 1, 2, 2. There's no 6, so we don't have to worry about getting rid of or skipping those numbers, so it's going to be 5. And then let's look at the second example, 1, 2, 2, 6, 9, 99, 99, 7. Because of that 6 and then the 7, we only take the first 3. So 1, 2, 2, which equals 5. And the last one, 1, 1, 6, 7, 2. We get rid of the 6 and then the 7 and anything in between, which is nothing. So it's going to be 1, 1, plus 2, which equals 4. Okay, so first off, let's get to the problem. We want to have a variable to store the sum, so int sum equals our default 0. And now let's loop through this entire thing. So, because we want to be able to add the values into our sum. So, 4 int i equals 0. i is less than nums.length i++. plus plus. Next, we want to make sure that this number that we're at isn't 0. So, let's check it. If nums i equal equals 6, then what should happen? We have to have it so that our index is moving up until the next 7. And we are, by the problem, we are guaranteed at least one 7. So we're going to make a while loop. So while nums i does not equal 7, we're going to be adding 1 to our index number. But if the number isn't a 6, we're just going to do else, and then we're going to do sums sum plus equals nums i. Then if we are to return this, return sum, then it should run and everything should work out.